Well, we were inside and just normal night of bowling and out of nowhere, he just came in and there was a loud pop. I thought it was a balloon. I had my back turned to the door. Um, and as soon as I turned and saw that it was not a balloon, he was holding a weapon. I just booked it um, down the lane and I slid basically into where the pins are and climbed up in the machine and was on top of the machines for about 10 minutes until the cops got there. <laughs> I don't know how to explain it. Um, I don't think you're supposed to see that in real life. I heard the first one, it was probably 15 feet behind me. I mean, he was close. He, when he heard the, uh, when he heard a shot, he heard a pop and he turned around and saw what was happening. So, he turned to the kids and said, act as shooter. Um, and he was right near an emergency exit. So I believe he herded them out that door. But as far as I know, he's uh, he doesn't know how he's gonna unsee some of the things that he saw. It, it, the carnage is it's terrible. <laughs> Frustrated, worried. We know a close friend has passed. We're sheltering in place. Um, I'm still working because I can work from home. Um, my husband canceled his jobs today to stay home with me. We're praying for everyone. Just everybody pray. Pray for those that are hurt. Pray for the families that have a loss.